this is just a little bit of an acknowledgement. The, I mean, the way I think about it is that, you know, you are valuable, you are loved, and I think most of all, you know, we, we see you. My name is Shelley Mann, and I'm the Inclusive Education Coordinator at Colonel Gray High School. And the program that we're working on today is, it's just a committee, it's called the Christmas Giving Committee. So the Christmas Giving program existed in some form when I came here about 13 years ago now. Um, so now we're up to about um, maybe, I think this year we'll probably do close to 150 gift bags. Um, and that's kind of grown over the years, but every single student that gets a gift bag is a student in need. And I guess that's just a reflection of, you know, society and, and how we have more and more people that are in need, right? We have a lot of students in our school, um, which is a reflection of the population, who really don't have very much. Um, they come from homes where there might be abuse, there might be extreme poverty. Um, and for them to get to school, even for them to get to school every day is, it's a big deal if they walk through our doors because they're going through so much at home. Um, so what we try to do is we just try to do something nice for them at Christmas time. So we put together gift bags. We ask businesses to donate and organizations such as such the church ask them to donate. We give the kids the necessities that they need. So we give them shampoo, we give them body wash, deodorant, soap, hats, mitts, socks, all those kinds of things, nothing fancy. Um, but it's things that some of these kids, believe it or not, wouldn't even have. Kids get excited about a really nice bottle of shampoo or you know, a toothbrush that they haven't been using for like a year or two years. So it's kind of a big deal even for them to get those things. I think these students, for the most part, a lot of times, feel forgotten. I think they, I'm going to cry through this, so I'm just going to cry through. Um, I think that they, they go through such hard times and, and some of them have very little support at home. It's not because their parents don't love them, right? It's because their parents are working really hard just to keep a roof over their head. And this is just a little bit of an acknowledgement. I mean, the way I think about it is that, you know, you are valuable, you are loved, and I think most of all, you know, we, we see you. We see you coming to school every day, even though you might not have something to eat. We see you getting here in the winter time with just, you know, old sneakers on your feet. Like, we see you as a person and you are valuable. It doesn't matter how much money you have, what kind of a house you live in, what kind of clothes you wear. You are valued and cared about by somebody. And that's what the program means to me and to them. Because I see it when they come in and they pick up their bags. And you know, it, it's so awesome because these are kids where you give them a bag full of stuff and then we have a box and, and it'll have odds and ends. So we try to give all the kids the same thing. And then if we get one-offs or things that we don't have, you know, 150 of to give every kid, we put them in a box. And I say, so you pick a few things out of the box, can be for you or can be for you know, maybe your mom or dad or a brother or sister at home. And they invariably pick out things for their parents or for their brother or sister. And they'll say, oh, like, this is so much. Like, I, you know, I need to leave something for the next person. And for people that have very little, for kids that have very little, I just, I just can't believe it sometimes. Like, I, I don't know what to say. Um, I do think high school students are sometimes forgotten. Um, I like to think of high school kids as little kids in bigger bodies, and I, I say that because that's really what they are. I have my own teenager at home, and he's still my baby in a bigger body. Um, and these kids are too. Um, and we often, I think, see little children 
that don't have a whole lot and we rush to help them and we think that because these kids are bigger and they look almost like adults that they don't need it as much but I would say that they need it every bit as much. I'm lugging things because I love these kids and these kids need this and they deserve it and it really does mean the world to them and I wish everybody could be in that office with me when they come in and they get this because it's just such a wonderful thing.